Instead of looking at each other cross eyes. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. We, we, we sit down and say, okay, how can we build? And we're going to take a lot of the skills and all the information and put it the curriculum. Right. But a lot of us are. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Have a look. All right. Take care. All right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 
about our business. Absolutely. And, so that, that tends to get called to the needs. And yeah. Things yeah. Like What's being done and the need is still out there. You don't mind much you showing what you're doing and yeah, sure, sure. how you're organized. How many, why don't you first tell them how many people are you feeding? We got uh, between, between 200 to 250 folks that we feed the volunteers. And then, uh, of course, through the distribution center, we uh, provide cases of food and cases of water and things like that for people to come up and, and, and get as they, as they come. And I think increasingly, as we encourage people to come back to the homes, the homes are in such poor condition with mold and, and uh, bacteria and things like this that you can't really store food. We're not from, from here, so, here, so it's going to be important for them to be able to uh, have places where they can go to get food. Hey, Mikhail. Well. Yeah, we have a lot of olive oil, but we have a snow balsamic vinegar. Huh? <laughs> well, I'm doing fine. All right. Uh, you know, we got fresh produce and, and, and things like this, and we try to make food that's not just, you know, something to fill their bellies, but yeah. something to you know, balance their diet. Do you want to do a half bowl of olive oil? Yeah. And, uh, yeah. He's a great uh, chef. <laughs> no, because we don't have a lot of olive oil. No, you guys have like. That's not a lot. That's fast, yeah, you can have olive oil and as much vegetable as you need. Actually, Sorry, y'all. We have more. The money needs to be washed. Yeah, but vegetable oil is still cheap. It's true. It's interesting. Spice I can't go any further. You got to meet her. <laughs> this is our residence here. Hi. Fine. I'm Dolores. She works with Danny. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Good. 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 Well, Mr. Dolores, why don't you tell them something about where you live? I live in a 1300 block of Pauline. Okay. And uh, I evacuated. Yeah, it's Sunday morning. It's about 5 o'clock. Okay. And I've been back here two weeks. Okay. I'm getting some help in my house. Okay. We could do family damage. They had about that much water in the house. You know, but they had moved every dollar in order to take half of the sheet right down. They've done that. So they're waiting for the girl next door to get started. She seems to be waiting on FEMA. FEMA not doing a thing for us. How's the time you want to get her out of here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Signing a lot of papers in that city. Yeah. 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 She's been all the way on parade. Yeah. Thank you, honey. <laughs> hey, sweetie. How you doing? I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Right about. Oh, 
I want y'all to meet Danny Glover. How you doing? My head is very dirty. Oh, yeah. Where you from, man? Oh, that's LA. LA. Yeah. Okay. This is the actual uh, sanctuary. place next door. It's already me. Where are you from, Brandon? I'm from Texas. Texas, okay. From Texas. Right. It's going to have an art and entrepreneurship program. Okay. It's going to kind of, kind of, a little historical, mm -hmm. but um, it's uh, going to have a different twist on it. It's an art and entrepreneurship so, program. As you can see, this is the uh, uh, sanctuary. Yeah. 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 Oh, no, yeah, yeah. Well, it's, it's going to have this art and entrepreneurship program that basically teaches young men and women how to use video cameras, how to edit the footage. They're mm -hmm. going to provide a space for it and then teach them how to contact the media and what kind of things, you know, what works and doesn't work. And uh, with the intention that it, A, it provides employment, like um, uh, self-employment, and then B, it, it putting a lot of cameras in the area might change the way people are doing it. I think it's already done that, you know? chance for Danny to meet your mother when right. you go. These cars will run you over. This is gonna be the new disco. Yeah. Well, I already explained that. Yeah. And then this guy Manuel who was one of the first people that called us from those notes on the door. <laughs> Us a lot to rent, and then the manual Thanks, said, Well, if we need a clinic, why don't we just use his mom's house? So, this is going to be the next clinic. And the sister's a nurse. Yeah. Hmm. Oh. Look at that. I got my mask, oh no. <laughs> Thank you. If you don't mind, I just want to stop a couple of them for a second. Come here for a second. I'm gonna explain to Danny what you're doing. 
I'll be taking off these, uh, uh, my door frames. I saw. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And all this stuff here, this is all the debris from inside the house. They just now started to do trash pickup here three months later. And then for the first time since we've been here, FEMA is going to start to talk the house and the night. Uh, for the SDS. They have it for two months. So Malik can't come back a lot of can't afford to get back. FEMA still hasn't talked the roofs. And so a lot of the damage in these homes, you see how low the water is? A lot of the damage is actually secondary from just not having the roofs part. But everyone else in town got the roofs part. Well, they, just, they just told us that today, like, that they're finally the meeting. So, yeah. so, yeah. so We have school in the lower nine. That's why I think the whole thing is that initiative. They were saying that these areas are unlivable, and they were going to build those in limited domain and take over the homes, and then after five years, give the people, if they had good credit, the option to buy back their homes with no cap on the price. And they're trying to use like green building and, and innovative building technologies as an excuse to like get the left, you know, if they sign on to. Um, the eminent domain tactics. Mm -hmm. We're doing that kind of around the country. Right now. Richard. Okay, that's finished. Hold on to it, and you stay out of the shot, okay? okay. What's your name? Sorry, bro. Lionel. Link, this is Lionel. He's telling me about his situation down the street. Hello. That's your girlfriend. No, everybody. Can I get a hug? Oh, bless you. Down here to take care of us. Uh, 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 we have uh, 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 Yes. Oh, they they bought uh, most of it up. Oh, uh, my car seat. This is all. No. Yes. Get it in there. 